Hey, Eric at Mercedes-Benz of the Woodlands here, and I'm with the all-new 2021 GLA. This is the second generation GLA, and it is amazing. The previous generation sold like crazy. It ran its life from uh, 2014 to 2020, and in 2021, we just uh, delivered the second generation. It's kind of like the old GLA went to college, maybe traveled to Europe, saw a little bit of the world, came back, and now it's just a little bit, a little bit more refined, a little nicer interior-wise, a little softer on the ride quality too. You can see it's a little bit larger, it's a little bit wider, a little bit taller. Uh, full LED headlights now in the front. This is actually kind of a, a base vehicle. As nice as this is, this isn't crazy optioned out. Uh, this is the twin five spoke wheel. You can get this with an AMG Sport package. And if you get the AMG Sport package, you'll have larger wheels, also more aggressive wheel options, sportier wheel options. You'll also get a more aggressive uh, front and rear fascia, um, as they call it. Front and rear bumpers will have more uh, aggression to them. And then you'll have a slightly lowered suspension on it. Ride quality is a little bit smoother, a little bit softer. You do have a little bit longer wheelbase on it, um, and you do ride a little bit higher on it. So if you, once again, if you like the dual clutch, you still have the dual clutch with this vehicle. So the transmission is very sporty, uh, fun to drive, easy to drive, more refined. That would be the, the term I would use. Engine is a two liter turbocharged uh, four cylinder, You're making 221 horsepower. 258 foot-pounds of torque. These will be one of two things. They'll be front-wheel drive or they'll be all-wheel drive. This car gets uh, just under 35 miles on the highway, 25, 26 in the city, just doing purely city driving. Where the real difference is, is on the interior. The interior is incredible. You have a fully digital gauge cluster now. You can do an optional uh, 10 and a quarter inch dual screen setup, the center screen being a touch screen. You also now, uh, straight from the E-Class and S-Class, have the touch pads on the steering wheel. The driver never has to take his hands or her hands off the wheel uh, as they navigate through the different menus and options inside. You also now have the haptic mouse in the center. Um, there's some great options on these. You can have a full pano sunroof or the regular steel top like this one has. The uh, sound system is now changed over to Burmeister. Rear seats break down into a 40-20-40 split, so now we can uh, lay the, the, all the rear seats down independently. Uh, power lift gate. You also now have the Mercedes Me Connect app on your phone, which allows you to turn on and off the car with your phone. Also allows you to lock or unlock the vehicle. And if you do have navigation uh, built in, it allow you to send maps directly to the vehicle. These are gonna come with MB Techs on the interior, which is super durable. It's a Mercedes manufactured textile. Uh, and we use it for a couple of reasons. Number one, you don't have to care for it like you have to care for normal leather. Number two, it's super durable. It won't absorb stains. We actually uh, debuted this material way back in the 60s when diesels were really big and diesel fuel and leather don't mix. Uh, it's also form molded. So the longevity of this material is way up there just because there's not the, the typical stress on the seams that there would be if you do use leather. If you're a kind of person that maybe is new to the brand, maybe you haven't considered Mercedes in the past, maybe you have always kind of looked at maybe Subaru, stuff like that, this is a great little crossover. Or if you're looking for a car that just gets phenomenal fuel efficiency, is a great commuter, a fun car, a fuel efficient car, this is an amazing option, especially if you're looking for something you can commute with during the week and then go out to dinner and have a nice vehicle to, to take out clients with. The GLA is a great option. If the GLA looks like something you might be interested in or if there's any other vehicles in the lineup that kind of strike your fancy, please feel free to reach out to me, Eric Beasley, Mercedes-Benz of the Woodlands.